welcome to the Dr. Gratitude official channel. I'm so grateful you have made it here. And if this is your first time tuning in, hello and welcome to this amazing channel. Please take the time to like and subscribe to follow along to all the daily gratitudes that I will be doing. My mission and my goal in life is to have an attitude of gratitude. And I want to spread that worldwide so people can have life satisfaction, optimism, love, hope, joy, peace, and of course, gratitude, because that's what we're here for. I'm taking people on a massive journey from day one to day 365 days of thankfulness to transform your world. Each episode, I go through a simple daily challenge, something published in my journal, and also a personalized journal entry to inspire you guys on how to do gratitude because it is the best attitude. Let's get into the daily challenge today. So I've been following along in my sober book and I absolutely love it. There's a lot of different activities to do. And today I found one and I was like, oh my gosh, I've got to do this one. How haven't I done this? Body appreciation. Focus on gratitude for the functions and abilities of your body. So what I want you to do is find a comfortable space and I want you to either sit or lie down and I want you to get into a relaxed position so then that way you can do this. Close your eyes if it feels comfortable and allow your body to settle in its position. And then I want you to start breathing in a few death, deep breaths to center yourself, inhaling slowly through your nose and then exhaling through fully through your mouth and allowing your breath to establish a calm and centered state. So we're going to embark on a journey of gratitude and self-love with body appreciation. This is a practice that invites you to focus on gratitude for all the functions and abilities of your body. So in this session, you'll cultivate mindfulness around the marvels of your body, fostering a deeper appreciation for its capabilities. And I want you to approach this practice with a gentle heart and commitment to acknowledging and cherishing your body's inherent gifts. Next, I want you to gently scan your body from head to toe with each part, expressing gratitude for its function. Acknowledge the gift of sight, the ability to hear, the sense of touch, and the many other functions that contribute to your well-being. Bring your awareness to the movements of your body. Appreciate the ability to walk, to stretch, to dance, and to engage in various activities. Express gratitude for the mobility and flexibility your body provides. Let's shift the focus to internal functions. Acknowledge the beating of your heart, the circulation of bud and the intricate process that maintains your body balance. Express gratitude for the silent and essential fu functions that sustain your life. Take a few moments to reflect on your body's resilience and adaptability. Appreciate how it supports you in navigating the complexities of daily life. And as you conclude your body awareness, Carry these gratitudes into your day and recognize the beauty and resilience of your body. Consider making body appreciation a regular part of your routine, fostering a positive and loving relationship with the vessel that carries you through life. So as you wake up and open your eyes, there are three reflective questions that I want you to journal. Your first question is, how did this practice of body appreciation impact your sense of gratitude and connection with your body? So take the time to journal in your book and see what comes up for you. Were there specific aspects of your body functions or abilities that stood out to you during this practice? And did you experience a shift in your overall perspective or feelings of gratitude as you engaged in this body, of, in this body appreciation session? And take the time to really reflect on those three questions. All right, guys. The whole reason why we're here is for this beautiful journal, Dear God, with gratitude, 365 days of thankfulness to transform your world. Day 135, Dear God, I am grateful for meditation. And aren't we? The last couple of days, that's what we've been doing. Thank you, God. I am grateful for being able to serve the community. Today, I facilitated a workshop with PCYC and I'm so thankful to be able to do this and talk about limiting beliefs. It was a deep dive and I hope the class got lots from it. We then signed my car spreading gratitude because it is the best attitude. So guys, this brings us to the end of the episode. Thank you so much for tuning in and getting this far. If you haven't liked and subscribed, please do so now. Otherwise, before I go, remember, gratitude is the best attitude. Peace out.